violent extremism program. We are also encouraging all individuals and organisation, uh, as organisations to engage in our democratic processes. Transnational crime is a serious threat to regional peace and security as it undermines good governance, corrodes the rule of law and, uh, and, and threatens sustainable development and economic growth. It costs the Asia-Pacific region an estimated $90 billion a year. In Australia, illicit drugs are still the, the business source of organised crime activity. While cannabis is still the, the uh, dominant illegal drug, ice and methamphetamine-style drugs are a massive and growing challenge. To fight this, we must work together, implementing things like the UN Con Convention Against Transnational Organised Crime. Uh, we can all do more with information sharing, particularly between our law enforcement agencies, and further implement the UN Convention Against Corruption, the UNCAC, and Financial Action Task Force. Australia has invested significantly in regional capacity building through the Australia Asia Program to combat tra trafficking in persons, which assists uh, the uh, ASEAN countries to strengthen their criminal justice responses. The Australian Federal Police works closely with regional counterparts on capacity building, intelligence sharing and joint operations. Australia is also committed to working with partners to combat, to combat people smuggling, human trafficking and transnational crime through the Bali processes. We have also enacted a comprehensive federal criminal laws to ensure the police have the tools at their disposal to detect and prosecute transnational organised crime through our Proceeds of Crime Act, our Anti-Money Laundering and Counter-Terrorism Financing Act, the Extradition Act and Mutual Assistance in Criminal Matters Act. The work in this field and that of combating terrorism will never end. We must be forever vigilant. Madam Chairman, Madam Chair, sorry, I commend Australia's draft resolution to the meeting and I thank you very much for your time here today. Thank you. Agradecemos la participación del señor.